as well as the Christians in Palestine. They are one family. They are living side by side together. Even we respect the messages from God. If it's Jew, if it's uh, Christian or Muslims, Palestine is the Holy Land. It's the land for peace. Berjumpa lagi di channel Nur Zeha. Terima kasih teman-teman semua dimanapun anda berada sudah mampir hadir dan tetap setia mendukung channel ini. Kiranya kita senantiasa di dalam perlindungan Tuhan dimanapun anda berada. Kali ini saya tertarik membagikan sebuah video percakapan antara Pendeta Gilbert Rumindong dan duta besar dari Palestina, yang dimana selama ini kita ketahui bersama banyak aja orang-orang. Ya, yang menganggap konflik yang terjadi saat ini di antara Palestina dan negara tetangganya yaitu adalah konflik karena masalah agama. Tetapi di sini beliau atau duta besar dari Palestina ini menjelaskan bahwa eh, agama Islam dan agama Kristen di Palestina itu hidup berdampingan dan sama-sama bersuka cita tak ada apa tipe pembicaraan mereka bahwa kedua belah pihak ini antara Israel dan Palestina ini adalah tanah yang diberkati Tuhan tanah yang dipilih Allah tanah perjanjian oleh Allah Merdeka saya sedang di kedutaan Palestina bersama dengan yang mulia duta besar Palestina dan hari ini kita mau bertanya tentang situasi Palestina karena banyak orang pikir oh situasi Palestina ini situasi agama tetapi sekali lagi saya mau tekankan the situation in Palestine is not about religion untuk itu kita mau tanya langsung kepada duta besar yang terhormat kita so his excellency so some people think that the problem in Palestine is fighting about religion. So what is actually happened now? Thank you uh, very much, my brother, you know, uh, for raising this question. Our cause is from the beginning, it's political cause mm -hmm. and political issue. It's not religious. Israelis, they are trying to deal in this way and to create this atmosphere. But Palestine, it's politically. And as you know that it's occupied by the Israelis since 1948. 40. And we are fighting to be free. We are fighting to be independent. Yes. As everybody living in this world. You know, all Palestinians are fighting together. Yes. It's not as they are mentioning that this is this a group and that a group. It's not yes. true. It's not true. Palestine should be free. Palestine should be independent. And we are having the right to do like that. But Israelis are changing the atmosphere. And they need to create very bad conflict, like religious conflict, which is cannot be accepted by our side. Palestinians, as well as Christians in Palestine, they are one family. They are living side by side together. Even we respect the messages from God. If it's Jew, if it's uh, Christian or Muslims, Palestine is the Holy Land. It's the land for peace. Yeah. It's not the land for killing or fighting. But Israelis ideology and Israelis in their strategy by support, unfortunately, and I'm sorry to say that, United States and some European countries, they create this conflict. And that's why the current situation is very serious and very dangerous on the ground, especially on Gaza. Even now in West Bank, daily they are uh, attacking uh, several cities, in Nablus city, in Ramallah city, in Hebron, in uh, uh, Tulkanam city, in Jenin. Wow. This is their, you know, uh, what they believe Israelis, they need to make that part warm to use their weapons against a human and civilians people. Hopefully, with my message to all international community, this aggression can be stopped. This aggression can be uh, taken in consideration 
by international community to walk hand by hand, voice to ask Israelis to stop killing and withdrawal from our land to reach for two state solution side by side. Thank so you. you need only peace living in your own place and two state solution. This so is Israel and Palestine can live together. We accept it. And our great leader Yasser Arafat in 1993 accepted that after Oslo occurred. And we are working for that. Who uh, make Oslo occur failed Israelis activities? Our hand and our president Mahmoud Abbas till now is ready to reach for peace. Man. All Palestinian is ready to reach for peace. But Israelis extreme leaders, settlers, they don't want. They need the land. They need to kill all Palestinians. This is the conflict. This is the reality. Everybody should know it's all over the world. This is their mentality. Israelis, they are working for that. They need to make Israelis large countries, as they believe, which cannot be. Palestinians on the ground. They are strong. They will remain, and they will continue struggling till they will reach for the freedom. Thank you. Saya juga ingin kasih dalam Tuhan, jadi jelas dijelaskan dua hal penting ini. Yang pertama, Palestina hanya mau damai. Supaya gencatan senjata terjadi, Israel keluar dari wilayahnya. Yang kedua, mereka mau tinggal dengan aman di wilayahnya. Yang ketiga, mereka ingin bahwa ada per penyelesaian dua negara yang dapat hidup berdampingan dengan damai. Jadi, saudaraku, Itulah yang harus kita doakan Satu damai Yang kedua Bahwa peperangan ini berakhir Masing-masing dapat tinggal dengan damai Dan solusi dua negara Israel tidak boleh menghabisi Palestina Palestina juga tidak boleh menghabisi Israel Karena dua negara ini Dua negara yang diberkati Seperti yang disampaikan This is Holy Land